Uh, what's going on, y'all? Back at it again. Back at it again with another live stream. Uh, what's going oh, on, shit. Bro? No, I ain't mean to start it like that. I'm trying to share this on my Facebook to let people know that we're going live right now, man. I feel pretty happy because I'm pretty, I'm off today, man. So I got all the free time that I need today to do what I need to do. Um, but, uh, you know, today, man, let me, oh, sorry, y'all, I'm fucking with shit right now, but this is for the live stream that, um, people that I, I that I put up, but got taken down, um, that live stream was taken down, well, the first one I did, the live stream I did, uh, I had put the video of Quando Rondo in it. So uh, that got blocked, you know, cause UMG, Universal Music Group owns that. So um, that's the reason why that video got taken down. I, I, I took that down. I mean, I could, I had the choice to put it back up if I wanted to just to take that part out. But, you know, it, it wasn't worth keeping. Plus the, the quality was terrible, but I got a new camera. I got a new dad, uh, webcam. And I still got the same microphone, so eventually I get some more stuff uh, as I go on. But live stream today, we're just going to look at some artists in Savannah. Um, for you guys that caught this already, I mean, I'll probably be covering some of the artists that I covered uh, in the last live stream before that one got taken down. But um, you know, we're going to look at some artists today. So that's what a lot of people been waiting on. I, you know, I, I'm sorry that that video got taken down, man. You know, I just didn't like the quality of it. Uh, how do I sound now? I know I, I should sound pretty good, but uh, we're going to get into it uh, immediately. I ain't going to waste no time. So um, right now, what I want to do is I want to show you all a page on YouTube um, and shout out to these two guys that's uh, working. Uh, in the city, uh, ASM Media and Real DSGB. Um, let me. Okay. Sorry, y'all. Yeah. Um, these two pages, ASM Media Group, um, and what's the other one? Uh, damn, I don't have his page up right now. But uh, these two guys, they've been pretty much doing a lot of work in Savannah as far as like working with artists. Um, I don't know their prices, but if you're looking towards like, you know, working and like just want to put your own musical video out, I suggest go to these two guys, ASM Media and, and Real DSGB. I don't have the info, but I'll probably link it in the description when I get done with this, uh, when I get done with this live stream. So, um, how everybody doing right now? Yeah, sound good. Yeah. I, I, I picture I sound good because you know the audio got messed up with the old camera. So, but anyways, man, we we gonna get into it right now, man. Um, I got a few videos I wanted to look at, but for the sake of the video that I did last that got messed up, we'll just look at um, why Peter Don video again, and you know, cause I owe it to him because. You know, when that video got taken down, his camp seen that video and they wanted to know what was up. They thought it got taken down because of copyright issues now. But like I said, we're going to get into it anyway. By Peter Don video entitled, We Want Up. I'm a 
the fire, I'm the sauce that I so put the little bit of bread right in the fire, yeah. You don't want what you don't eat, got no use for me, that's a little bit of a meal, but it's sweet, we need the power for the move, so let's drop some drugs. Give a fuck, you get all the dudes to be done, you know what? y'all um that was why peter dawn song entitled we want up uh just in case you was wondering who the artist was but yeah why peter dawn um i know his camp watch me i guess um hopefully and this goes for anybody else hopefully pretty soon i can start doing back interviews kyle I'm, I'm pretty interested in doing an interview with with this guy but uh, I know the weather is kind of up and down. And you know when I do my interviews, I always do it in, in the outside. So I can't really provide an a in-house place. Now, let's see if y'all guys have an in-house place that I can do an interview. Because I kind of hate to do it outside now because you know you got to factor in the wind. And if it's real windy outside, then it's going to sound, the, you know, the audio is going to sound ter terrible if I do the interview. So I've been kind of waiting on doing interviews until about the summertime because that's when the weather is just hot you know it's not windy outside it's just you know it's kind of like perfect temperature even though it's hot so uh why peter don um pretty soon man i'll try to link up with you or y'all guys can link up with, with me man you know the gmail is in the description and you know we'll go from there but you know I, i'm interested in this dude because um you know this is the only song that i that i've heard from him i know he got plenty of other songs but um you know this guy is um no, this guy's pretty good. You know, it's not like your average street rap or anything like that. You know, he's he's talking about coming up, you know, and everybody can relate to that. So um we'll we'll, just, we'll see. Yo, what's going on, John? <laughs> what's going on, man? Um so yeah, man. We're gonna get into another artist. It's several artists I gotta cover, man. And this is like the makeup live stream because some of y'all already seen some of the videos well not all of them because there's a few new videos that was released but i gotta let's talk about this guy um now i gotta talk about gutter screw for you guys that don't know gutter no this video is off of uh what was video off of yeah real dsgb yeah he's the other guy that does uh music videos in savannah so if y'all want to Hit him up. He's pretty good too. Um, but Gutter Screw, he got caught up in some shit recently this week, uh, involving some type of probation uh warrant or something out on his arrest. And you know, I didn't know it was him until like you know, I seen the photo. Uh, but um, like like I said, he don't stay in Savannah, he stay in Atlanta now. You know, this this is the brother of Spencer Stuckey, the the teenager that was killed in that accident on uh what that was last year no two years ago when that car crash happened on july the 4th you know so you know that's his brother but um 
got a screw. I don't know if he locked up yet or if the police caught him, but um, got a screw himself. He's somebody that's been going through a lot of stuff, you know, in his personal life, you know, getting shot like six times, uh, you know, losing his brother, you know, of course, having active warrants out on him. So, you know, his life is going in a crazy spin right now, but hopefully he gets his stuff together, man, because, you know, I do want him to, you know, the the win in, in the whole situation. So uh, we're going to get into it. Got to screw uh, No Loyalty uh, video by Real DSGB. So uh, take a look. and uh yeah man so that's the music video by gutter screw entitled no loyalty by filmed by a real dsgb you know like i said he does a lot of work with savannah artists uh yeah he died in 2017 okay it didn't seem like that it happened that far away man but um yeah you know listen to him how he looked like he don't look like how like he would sound like on the on the mic so um there's a lot of the reason why i like him man is like because you know it's real music at the end of the day you know everything ain't popping tags wearing fly, wearing uh clean clothes and driving fancy cars you know the, the, you know the streets is the streets you know it's talking about you know people getting killed setups robberies drug dealing you know all oh, that's a part of the street so um you know and pain is a part of it so another good video by gutter screw 
Um, oh, and, and, the, and the respond to uh, what you were saying, John. Pretty soon, I'm going to start doing uh, a little bit more kid-friendly videos. Uh, you know, because that's like my second biggest audience, like teenagers for some crazy reason. But uh, I'm gonna start doing a lot of like work with the with the youth and like children pretty soon, man. I'm just trying to get everything together that I need to get together. And, you know, it'll probably be in the summertime, but I'm gonna try to start doing a little bit more kid friendly videos. Uh, not even really, not even really necessarily like kid friendly, but just more so like. You know what are the kids going through now, and how how are they thinking? And, you know, and the, and the mentality of the, of the kids, and um, it, it's gonna be good. But anyways, man, we are gonna get into the next video. Um, I guess we can look at another video that was posted two days ago by a person named Ace Don Dada that was featured on ASN Media's YouTube page. So a Guy's name is Ace Don Dada, uh, music video entitled Dollar Sign. So we're going to check it out. Okay, uh, that's what's up. Um, tell me how y'all like that. It's on daughter. And by the way, can y'all hear the the music pretty good? I know you ain't gonna hear it to like the hundred percent DVD quality, but uh, does it sound pretty good? But yeah, man. I mean, dude, this song sound pretty good. Um, it's kind of funny because like on the hook, he kind of sound like DMX almost. You know, I might be reaching when I say that, but um. That sound pretty good, man. Um, it sound cohesive. Everything sound like it was like the his lyrics are sound like it was made for the beat. Um, you know, it's he it sound he sound pretty good, man. And shout out to uh the guy that make the the free lunch. 
uh, shirts, man. You know, that guy's making an impact on the community as well. But uh, and also you'll see those shirts uh, passing passing around. Uh, you'll see those shirts in different musical videos. Oh, let me go back. Yeah, at a, a free lunch shirt. So yeah, man, good video. I like the way. I like the way that he pretty much flowed on this. You know, it, it was a one. You know, buddy, 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 pretty good. Um, I don't know too much about this guy or where, what side of town he's from, but um, I don't know. Maybe I might hear something from him in the near future. But we're gonna keep this thing rolling, man. Um, we're gonna look at the next next video. Um, by ASM Media again entitled uh well i don't know if it's a person or a group entitled our generation uh, it's called all in it and i was going to click on it but i seen that it got a good bit of views on it so uh we'll just see what it do man here you go
All right. So, damn, I, I like that. I ain't gonna lie. Uh, so tell me how y'all feel about that latest music vid video by our generation entitled All In It. I ain't gonna lie, it's pretty motivational, man. Um, shit, that's some shit I can work to. If they don't put you all in it, you know, shit, that's easy motivational speech right there. You know, um, the track itself, I, I like the beat, first and foremost. Um, the track itself, you know, somewhat of a motivational track, you know, talking about you know, just putting your best foot forward, you know, go go all in it, you know. So uh pretty good. I haven't heard of them before, but I'm pretty sure this won't be the last time I'm heard I, that I heard of them. So we'll see what type of stuff that they'll pop out in the near future. So um we're gonna keep this thing moving again, man. I know I'm I'm rolling pretty fast. Uh, if you're watching right now, man, give this thing a thumbs up right now, man. Um, shout out to everybody that's watching right now. And uh, we're going to get into the next video. I know I'm going pretty fast, but um, some of y'all already seen some of the stuff that I, I'm talking about. Except for this one. I, I haven't talked about this one because this one was pretty new. Um, so, yeah. I, you know, give it a thumbs up, man. So, we're going to go into the next video uh, by D-Boy Marley. Entitled Jordan 23. This is by Real DSGB. Again, uh, you know, shout out to these two guys. You know, they put they put out a lot of work. There's some other videographers in Savannah. Don't get me wrong, you know, but these guys probably put out the most. But you know, there's there's other people like Kari Conceptions, uh, Just Shoot Films, uh, Seaport Films. I mean, it's a it's a lot of other guys, man. You know, don't get me wrong. So, uh, but yet. Yeah, Anyways, we'll go into the next video by D-Boy Marley and Jordan 23. Let's go. Right through the city, took them for the night, night. 
Another video by D Boy Marley. Um, pretty good video about D Boy Marley. If you don't know who he is, he had another video out called Fuck Cancer. Um, he made that video because his girl at the time died of, of cancer. Uh, it's a good video, man. If you ain't checked it out, you should see it. But um, that video had a lot of traction. I mean, it was that video was like years and years old, but um. That that uh that music video or that track itself, you know, it inspired a lot of people that was going through cancer. So um and I was supposed to do a video about that, but I just never had the time to do it. And uh he got mad at me. So, you know, I, I only think it's fair that I just cover a music video by him, you know. So pretty good music video, Jordan 23, you know. That's when hip hop kinda imitates basketball. And art, you know, balling on these holes, Jordan three, you know, the, the LeBron references, you know, so good music video. And I probably look at one more. Now, if y'all want to look, want me to look at another video, um, feel free to type in who y'all want me to look at. Um, oh, actually, you know what? I gotta, I forgot about, uh, do up King, he dropped a, a music video called Plays. We can uh we can watch that. Um you know what I say that for an end. But, you know, we'll uh we'll look at uh, another video by another artist. Uh, I believe he's from Savannah, uh Lil Joe. So we'll check it out and see who this is. Savannah had a violent weekend. Two homicides and a 14 year old boy shot. WJCL News, what can you take a closer look at the high numbers in Savannah? Get this, more than 31 homicides this year. We're digging deeper, I'm covering the number of unsolved murders. Reality is a life, that's what I always give you. I'm cried out, no more tears, no more me and tissue. Reality is a life, that's what I always give you. This foot of trenches across the world, I feel your pain, nigga. A cold world, so much bullshit it did to us. Remember smoking weed, open the backseat of the school bus. Slaying friends I did it with, there to eat the locked up. Schools ain't safe, pray for Texas, they shot that school up. Reality is a life, make you shiver between satin sheets. Concrete jungle, we kill. Just for a plate to eat, be careful when you walk it down Burroughs and 39th Street. So many mamas lost their child right there on that same street. So many memorials and blood bundles on concrete. Names called in with a title that's reading R.I.P. Rest in peace to Tyree, killed by the Metro Police. Rest in peace to Tory T. Auntie Deborah barely even sleep. Moment of silence. Moment of silence. My father told me, he said, son, when you drop this CD, call it Realities of Life. Get in the streets what I taught you, because it's all based on Realities of Life, son. Whoa. Reality is a life, that's what I always give you I'm cried out, no more tears, no more me and tissue Reality is a life, that's what I always give you This foot of trenches across the world, I feel your pain, nigga 
Like, get all this, like, this ain't, this is, this is reality, it's a life right here, man. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Live in the trenches, man. Straight up, all the way. Shit. Okay, tell me how you feel about that video. I ain't gonna lie. I like it. Um, started off with the news reporter talking about the homicides. Uh, a lot of homicides that, well, not homicides, but a lot of the deaths that he talked about, you know, I covered in music video or in, in news videos. So, uh, kind of, kind of glad that somebody is up to date on what the hell I'm talking about, you know? So, um, you know, like he, like he said, uh, a lot of kids lose their life on 39th and Burroughs. He ain't joking about that. So, um, yeah, it was a good video, man. Oh, oh I got to play it back what he said. Yeah. So yeah, I mean, buddy, buddy, speaking about something about you know about the streets, and then, you know this is what I like, you know, don't give me the fairy tale rap, you know, give me what I need to know. So a uh, good video by this dude named Lil Joe. Uh, we were going to get into the last video, and I got, I'm a jet out of here, man. Um, you know, so we're gonna get into the last music video uh, by Duop Kane entitled "Plays." Um, Duop Kane is a, a young kid, man. He's from Savannah. He's from the South Side. Um, you know, I don't know. I don't think he's living in Savannah right now. I think he's living in Cali. But young, young kid. I think he like 16, 17 or some shit like that. Uh, yeah, I played, I played why Peter Dunn. I played that, that, that in the, in the first video. Well, in the, the first video that I played was why Peter Dunn. But, um, Duop King, you got a video out called Plays. I thought it was pretty nice to, you know, check out the video. So we're going to check it out and see what it do. Oh, shit. I ain't got my audio set up. <laughs> okay. Now we ready. video by Duwap King entitled Plays. Duwap King, like I said, from the south side of Savannah. The dirty, mean trenches of the south side, man. Um, shout out in, in the actual music video because look, like he was at the Parkers off of uh, Largo on the south side. So, you know, buddy, buddy coming up, man, you know, um, you know, the, the way to the come up, you know, it's a slow grind. But buddy, you know, he putting out more music. I noticed that about him now. You know, buddy putting out more music, and, you know, maybe he'll be the big dog. You know, he, maybe he'll be the next uh, next guy to, to blow. 
you know, but I mean, he's, he is pretty successful, man. So, I mean, this guy, yeah, be looking out for him, man. Uh, Duop King. And I, and I talked to him before. I uh, want to do an interview with him in the near future, but we'll see how that plays out, man. But um, that's all for right now. I'm going to get out of here. And I don't know. I might do part two of this later on tonight because I know there's some more. I just got to gotta hop back in the streets and do some shit, man. So um, we'll, we'll get back to it if I don't do this later on tonight. You know, I got nothing but time tomorrow. So uh, part two. We'll watch some more Savannah artists. So I'm going to get out of here, guys. Thank you all for watching.